Hi everyone, welcome to my channel, So Simple. Today we are going to learn how to make a jumpsuit that you could wear for the holidays. So I purchased this kind of um, sort of velvety type fabric and it has stretch on one side, one way stretch. And you could use pretty much any fabric as long as it has some stretch to it so that you don't have to add a zipper to your project. So this is what I've done so far. I took a pair of jeans and I folded the jeans um, with the back part out so that this part here is going to be longer. And I took the t-shirt and I folded the t-shirt to the point where my waist would be and then I took some chalk and I traced around it now just keep in mind that I have left enough space when I um, traced I want to leave enough space for all the sewing that I have to do so um, that's what I did I continued here to make it one long piece and then I went down and left I kind of went a little out at the bottom of the hem so that the pants could be not so tight at the ankle area. So um, this is my whole piece of fabric. I took half of the fabric only. This is half. And I folded that part one time. Because what I did here, I'm going to now fo fold that part and do it again with the shorter side. So do that. Trace around so that by the time you finish tracing, it should look like this. It should look like that. Um, I actually have a video on how to do a jumpsuit, but this is by far the easiest way to do it. And you're going to get even a better effect. Okay, once you've traced around your jeans and your top, you're going to cut where you traced. I left a little bit of room when I traced and then when I cut I left another um, small amount right here. Um, sometimes unless you just want to measure yourself so that you know exactly how wide you want something to be, you uh, always cut a little bit more than you need so that you have um, room for your seam allowance. So this is one side that I've already cut. I'm going to now fold the other one and cut my other side. Okay, I just want to explain real quick what I've done so far. Um, when I put my pants and my t-shirt, I cut two separate pieces. And um, each piece was done with folded fabric. So you have a total <coughs> of two pieces and two pieces. Now, what you have to remember is that one of the pieces, the part right here, should be longer than the other part. This, is, this just means that this is going to be the front of your outfit and this is going to be the back of your outfit. So remember that when you put the pieces together, you have to separate them when you cut them and then line up one long piece with a short piece. Once you do that, you're going to pin two pieces together. This is the bottom of your arm of the armpit area and you're going to pin it all the way to the bottom and you're going to do that to both sides. Once you do that, the part that you've pinned, you're just going to sew. Okay, you're going to sew all of that on both sides. Alright, once you sew those two pieces separately, you're going to kind of put this and put your arm through the armhole here and you're going to kind of fit yourself to make sure that it's not too wide for you. In case you need to cut, you still have time to do that. Okay, so like a quick fitting will be um, the right time to do this. Okay, now what you're going to do, um, you're going to lay out your pieces the way I have them laid out like this. And you're going to take the center which is a small section and you're going to pin those together from this point all the way up to the top of your outfit do not pin the legs 
then you flip it over and you do the same with the other side remember you're doing it from this area up leaving the legs as is okay so now you have these pieces together and it's beginning to look like a pantsuit and what you want to do is you want to line up the seams in the center of the legs inside the pants make sure that the seams are properly lined up so that the lines look um, straight when you put these on and then just pin around and you're going to now join you're going to now sew the inside of the legs so once you have the center lined up you could either start from the bottom and just sew all the way like this or you could start here sew down but then you gotta go back so whatever way is easier for you once you sew that together um, the whole piece is pretty completed all you have to do is sew the top the shoulder area you could hem it and then um, we're going to add sleeves I left a part of the back of mine open um, this is just to show you what I've done with the back of my jumpsuit I when I was sewing these two pieces together I continue sewing all the way this way on one side and that way on that side I left this part open and then I added this is some kind of um, a strap okay I've got a video on how to add sleeves already but so I'm gonna make this um, as quick as possible you take the sleeve area of the jumpsuit I took two pieces of lace these are two pieces and then I put them on top of each other and I folded that in half because I'm just going to cut out the two sleeves at one time you line it up like this and then you're going to cut you could either use a chalk to trace or you could use pins because what you want to do is you're going to cut around this like this okay when I cut it I'll show you what that means once you cut them out you're going to pin you're going to separate these and you're going to pin from one end to the other on both sleeves and you're going to sew those pieces together okay so once you sew the sides of your sleeve you're not going to attach it to your jumpsuit and the most important part about the attachment is that you line up the seams so that they are together so you line up the seam from the bottom of your sleeve with the seam from the bottom of the armpit of your um, jumpsuit and then you pin the four sides first to make sure that you have it straight and then you put as many pins as you want and what you're going to do now is you're going to go to your machine and you're going to just sew where you've pinned all around so that you could um, sew your sleeves together do that to the other side and you're pretty much done